What's up, guys? My name is Kiata. Back at you guys with a lit one today. I'm coming at you guys with a story time video, you know, and I'm going to be doing a face cam video uh, this time around. Let me know down in the comments if you guys like this type of content and would like more of that. So I'm going to be doing a story time video today, uh, face cam wise, you know, a little different type of video. And uh, yeah, man, I wanted to get into that. So I want to pick from a list, like the best fucking, the best. Um, like I basically have a list like the, of my videos that like ideas for videos and this is the best this is the best way I can uh, you know come up with ideas fast enough. So I'm gonna talk about something funny. <laughs> so okay, let's see here. Hmm. All right, well, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about my first ever job, man. Like this job was crazy, man. So McDonald's, man. This it's just crazy. Like there's a chick here that was like coked out, and she got caught doing lines in the back. She still, she still kept her job, right? And and also like there's also a dude I met that like did psychedelics out here. So I was like, hey, man, that's lit. So I mean, I was like, okay, shit, man. I wanted to make the topic about this, so hope you guys stay high, stay lifted. By the way, before we get before we get in the video, I'm gonna be taking a dab on my little whip it, my little whip it fucking bone right here. And uh, yeah, funny story, I got this from like ordering nitrous, so got a little sticky from that shit, man. But yeah, man. So let me know now in the comments if you guys like these face cam videos because I'm gonna be doing more of them now. No, I'm seeing more subscribers on the channel. You guys are enjoying my content. So, yeah, man. I want to be doing other stuff to keep you guys, you know. You know, to feel like you're, you know, you're out here, you're, you're smoking with me or, you know, something, you know. Like you're kicking with me because uh, I'm pretty lit, man, myself. I have my fun. But anyways. So, I'm fucking. <clears throat> so, I applied to this job around, like, November. It was, uh. Yeah, I was just, like. You know, any other one minimum wage job around the time I was, um, I just had just turned 18, right? And yeah, it was just crazy, man. <clears throat> so, right, right, and then also happened around the time, like, I was actually doing Molly around that time, like, I had just got into that shit, so it was a really bad time to be, I mean, I guess to be doing, you know, because it was my first ever job. It's not a good idea, man. So, I mean, you know, I just I had to live and learn. You know, I was young. I was, I was, I was, I was young and done. Hope you guys are staying high, stay lifting, man. Take a hit with me. But yeah, so this job was pretty lit, man. I ended up being in that chick that they coked too, because I guess she was coked out. I'm pretty sure she was coked out. But anyways, so besides the point, that's besides the point. Oh, I got my sparkling water too. Pomegranate dragon fruit. Can't go wrong with that, man. So, you know. This job was just crazy ass experience. I never said the first job. Like I thought, her first job would be whack, but this job wasn't that whack. It was the first job. So, this coked out girl gets caught doing coke one day, right? I'm like, this bitch, right? And she doesn't know really what she's doing. Like at this point, but she was the funny thing is she was older and she had like kids, so she was like fucking up. And she's like 28 around this time. I was 18. So yeah, I was 10 years older. So yeah, it was crazy shit, man. It was funny shit. So yeah, I had uh, a lot of experience with that chick. I mean, she put, she came up, like she came through with like beer one time. I was like, hey, that's lit. That's lit. And yeah, other shit too. And yeah, she would hook up some shit too. That chick liked me, but nah, but she she was cheating though I have found out so not good at any but anyways so I got 
And I hooked up with that chick a little bit. I fucking... But the funniest thing, I met this guy, this psychedelic guy through this job as well. So I was like, holy shit, man. This dude is pretty freaking cool. And he had MDA. He had fucking acid, shrooms. Man, he had plugs for like a lot of shit. So it was crazy. He would lean. So yeah, I was turned into a little drug fiend. There's a lot of drug fiends around on fucking area, man. Like, it was just nuts, dude. Like, crazy. But anyways, wasn't that bad, but, you know, it, it can get bad, you know, sometimes. So, you know, yeah, I lasted that job, I think, around, like, two years, man. Two years. Or, no, not, not two years. It was almost almost two years, but, no, nah, it was a year. It was, like, a it was like 13, 14 months. So, I lasted long enough, I guess. I had a good run. But anyway, so I was just lit, man. And, oh yeah, funniest thing. I also was smoking weed in this job. So, they actually gave me three chances. The reason why I left the job was because they caught me smoking weed in the back. And I also felt like it was time to go. So, I'm like, I'm done, you know. So, I just didn't want to. I didn't really want to show up no more, man. Because it's, it's always already like a year and like a month of me working there. You know, it's been a long time. Unless some shit was going down around the time, so it was crazy, man. I wanna say I wish I was working again, cause uh the shit that happened after I started work I stopped working was just nuts, man. It was bad. But anyways Yeah, McDonald's is a nutty place. Nutty place. But anyways, yeah the people were there, there's a whole bunch of Coke addicts of a Michigan. It's like a it's Orange County, man, so you can imagine. I mean, it's like, it's not that far from LA. It's not that far from LA. It's from, it's like in the middle of uh, like San Diego and LA. And, you know, it's a pretty fun place, man. I like it. My first ever job, shit. Leave down in the comments, like, your story, first ever job. Like, if it hasn't been shitty, good, man, because this shit was all right. I remember I was just like, flipping those burgers, bending them back. I was just kicking that shit. I was working. I was doing good, man. And, yeah, I was proud of my shit, too. Because it's very important to be proud of your stuff, man. That's the best way. Yeah, man, so. I don't know. What else that? What's happened to this job? Oh, yeah, I just, like, sold Molly. I just sold weird drugs sometimes. Like, I would just bring some shit, like. And I'd be doing some stuff. I remember there's a time I came. One of my videos I made, I came to this job. On Molly, like after I did Molly, I was like, damn, bro. I was like, this shit's crazy. And, dude, it was nuts. And, uh, that second video, I'm like, going to walk around Molly again. That, that, that video was, I had this other job, restaurant job. But yeah, I don't really do that shit because I don't like to do that shit. Not at work, especially. But, you know, recently I did roll dope. So, yeah. Yeah. I was addicted to that before, but I don't really. I'm not really addicted to it anymore. I don't. Know, I don't really care. Like I, I it was like a weird, it's a weird phase in my life, and then I stopped doing it eventually. And then I was like, hey, you know, I'm good now, you know. But uh, I remember like, yeah, like, there was some chicks there too, and I was just out of high school, you know. I was I was in high school while at the job, and then I got out of high school, and then was still in the job. So. Yeah, the whole rest of the year I was in a job, and I was doing pretty well, man. I'm gonna be honest, doing pretty well. And it's like, and it's like some stupid shit. Some people trying to say some shit, but you know that's how it happens because the jobs are fucking dumb. But yeah, so the shit that happened to yeah, like some coke, coke head ass bitch got caught doing coke. That ended up hooking with. Uh, I got. A psychedelic plug that ended up actually, um, he actually accused me of stealing one time and I actually never stole anything. And then uh, that was all over after that. Or like, it just looked like I was stealing, but yeah, he was annoyed or something. I don't know. And he was like going through some weird shit. He must have been going through some drug come downs as well as she had on. Um, I don't know. But anyways, yeah, I just like, met that and I just met so many weird experiences and people, man, that it's kind of shaped my life a bit, you know, and it shaped my channel a bit because a lot of these experiences come from that stuff and it has shaped my, you know, understanding of these substances. And up until like, I think a few months ago or a year ago, I was doing research chemicals. 
not 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 a lot not like addicting not like an addictive way i was ex- just experimenting like just definitely experimenting and can you find them most of them are pretty safe but some could be dangerous but don't be doing them you know you never know and you never know which one's real which one's not but anyway so yeah like i was doing research chemicals and that was my last little phase of probably doing drugs like a lot and then now i'm not really doing that much stuff. except some like casual benzo flubomazolam you know all that stuff, and, you know, it's pretty fun, man, like, what, like, it's fun to have experimented, and now you don't really feel like, you don't need to, you don't need these drugs, you don't really truly need them all the time, you know, sometimes you might even get sick of it, because it's not the best thing that you can be doing all the time, and, you know, sometimes working out and getting outside is better high, man, so, yeah, man, I hope you guys stay high, stay lifted, and, uh, you know, smoked one. I'm about to smoke another bowl right now. Yeah. Pack a bowl right now and smoke on for me, man. And, uh, yeah, man. You done comments if you guys want more of these little face cam videos. Trying out something different for this channel. And, yeah, man. So. Can't fucking hide the motherfucker. Yeah, man. So, ready to bowl, man, and uh, cheers, man. Let's, let's smoke a bit, smoke a little bowl right now. Alright, man. I hope you guys are staying high, still lifted. Enjoy this video, the face cam. And uh, yeah, man. See you guys in the next one. Peace.